We don't get to see these dogs too much. There's only about between 220 and probably 250 left in the Kruger National Park. So it's very, very privileged that we get to see the packs. Very good morning to everybody. We're right up in the north. Um, this morning we had reports of a pack of 18 wild dog that crossed from um, Mangala into us. So we're up here checking if we can find those wild dogs. But I'm just watching the sunrise in the east here. Also listening to the morning chorus, the dawn chorus. Great to hear the hyena wake us up first thing in the morning. Came across three black black jackals. You can see the red bull ox pecker moving into that zebra's ear to feed all the ticks. family of Vinyalas. All here they often hanging around in very very thick thick bush. Very shy antelope. Sticks to the thickets as I was saying. But a beautiful antelope. With the help of some other vehicles, we've managed to find some wild dogs. I'm not too sure if it is the same pack that we were looking for, but it's wild dogs. Painted wolves. They are resting, they've probably been moving the whole of the morning. They look like they have two fatter bellies, but uh, great to see the wild dogs again. Dogs are still pretty away, not 100% asleep. I'm sure if something did go past here they would spring into action and still only see four dogs. Sometimes it's nice to just sit with wild dogs when they're not moving because they can move at a rate of knots. They can move between 25 and 50 kilometers in a day if they need. And sometimes it's nice to just have them sitting still and being able to video them and show all the viewers painted wolves. We don't get to see these dogs too much. There's only about between 220 and probably 250 left in the Kruger National Park. So it's very, very privileged that we get to see the packs. We're very lucky at Tinswalo we get quite a few numbers of packs that come on the reserve. It's nice and open. There's a lot of impala which is their main source of food and uh, yeah, to see them is very special. We probably only see them once every two weeks so it's a very very rare animal to see compared to lions and leopards which we've seen so every two to three days.
came past Wild Dog Dam. There's a big herd of buffalo here at Wild Dog Dam. It's a very good sign for us going into the, the winter months. We've got a lot of water on our concession, so you're going to get a lot of buffalo herds moving in here. We've also got a lot of good grass, panicum grass along the river lines, what the buffalo love. So together with the water and the good grass, get the herds of buffalo, which then bring the prides of lion. So have to wait and see if the lions will follow this herd of buffalo. We're still quite far south of where the berries and tinswala males will see. But you never know, the Naurus could be following this herd of buffalo. It's just great to see buffalo here. It's so nice to have a sunset. Different colours. Just enjoy the sunset through the knob thorn trees.